Ten to shoot for Davis. Watches a three and hits. John L. Davis, if it's three, it's me. John L. Ten on the shot clock. Davis waves his teammates out of the way and drives and scores. Back to back plays there by Davis. He saw his long ball shot, but he can take. Last foul was on Tony. Tony. Gaines just basically shoved the screener out of the way, and Davis bumped his defender and hits the step back triple. Well, we said this was a rivalry game, and you saw it there with the physical activity. For the rebound, Martin, great hustle. Boyd hit ahead to Davis. Nelly to the rim. Just such great control there by Davis. He reads defenses so well. Get there. Under five to go, under four and a half, actually. Davis with the step through. And a timeout from Andy Kennedy. Foul's on the prowl. Davis got it off to Weatherspoon, who can't finish at the rim, but he grabs the rebound. Davis steps outside the arc and drills it. 19 first half points for John L. Davis. Gaffney double team. Davis, great lob down low. Golden elevates and dominates. So he is still kind of learning the game. He really just started picking up in 2019. Started his career at Western Arizona. John L. Davis triple is on the money. Davis has to stop, picked up where he left off in that first half. Fourth triple now, one for 10 outside the arc. Davis with the fadeaway. He is just money today. He is so tough to defend. On a 9-4 run to cut this down to 17. Nine to shoot, Carroll. Spin move in the paint. Dumps it down low, Davis. And Nelly, count it, and one. Well, what a play there by the Owls. We talk about their unselfishness. Carroll getting into the middle of the lane, moving, I think, two or three spin moves there and still being able to make that extra pass under the bucket. You see, again, they keeping their eyes up for their teammates who they know are great at backdoor. FAU will slow it down just a little bit with 7.40. Davis for three. Rattles it in. His fifth triple of the game. He's got 30. Oh, he called off the rest of the FAU on the rim. And Gaffney again does the smart thing. Finds Davis. Carroll with the reverse. I mean, totally that's just textbook basketball right there. Is the Owlsboro? Is that what we call it? The Owlsboro, yes. Yeah, okay. You can tell that it's such a great community team. Everything. The Owls are really kind of finding their vibe after a couple of those first losses. All right, let's check in with Morgan Uber and John L. Davis. John L., we saw you hit the ground there pretty hard in the last 90 seconds. First off, how are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing, it was just a little tweak. That's all. I was good, though. What toughness was required from this team here in this game to grind out this win? Can you repeat that? What toughness was required of this team to grind out the win today? Uh, we know what we had to do, and, and uh, the coaches said it from the jump. And we came out and, and with great intensity, and we came out with the W. Yeah, speaking of great intensity, you had 10 points in the first five minutes of this game. What led to your quick offensive success early? Uh, I seen one go in, and my uh, teammates kept feeding me, in it, and I was hot for them. For Yaxel Lindeborg for UAB, he has put up 20 points in the past three games. Defensively, I know it was a big point of emphasis to bring pressure. How were you all able to neutralize him today? 